Good morning, Facebook. Good morning. Uh, it's Jerry. I'm coming to you live from, from Rhythmia Life Advancement Center in, in Guanacaste, Costa Rica. Uh, we have a pretty unique uh, life advancement center here uh, where, where many, many miracles uh, happen down here. And, and we do things in a particular way. This, this center is, we believe it's different from anywhere on earth. And uh, what we believe in at Rhythmia is this, I hope you can see this, this uh, uh, splitting of self. And, and what we do here is we actually, we actually put this back together. Uh-huh. And, and we've been super, super, super successful at it. Uh, I missed last week because I was in St. Kitts um, with two partners of mine for over 20 years. And we had a wonderful, wonderful time. Hey, Marina. And, uh, <clears throat> and I just wanted to say John Jacob uh, ran my programs for me. And we had an amazing week of healings. Super, super, super great healings. And it was a wonderful time. And uh, I was interesting because I was in St. Kitts and St. Kitts is like, um, you know, people will talk about it as like uh, its own heaven. And St. Kitts is gorgeous, but I could not wait to get my feet back here at Rhythmia because something is very, very, very different at Rhythmia than anywhere else in the world. It has, a, I don't know, it has a presence and a pull. And once you're here, and once you experience this in the community of it, you're just changed. You are just changed. It's, it's, there's something that goes on here that is incredibly unique in the world. So please today, if, if you think this broadcast is gonna help someone, kindly just press share for me. Uh, it's simple to do, you just press share if you think this is gonna help someone. And today I'm gonna talk about something pretty interesting. And talk about happiness. People all week are saying to me, why are you so happy? Why are you so happy? Why are you so happy? I guess, and I didn't even notice how happy I was. Uh, and it was interesting too because I came back to, from St. Kitts and that was a great experience. And, and I was just here. And I was just doing my thing and I was actually hurried and trying to get like ready. We have 60 guests this week. Um, and, and, and trying to get ready for them and getting everything done. And, and I didn't know it, but I'm, I'm just so happy. So I started thinking about it. And, and really what it comes down to is the intentionality of my own life. So, so, so I created an existence that makes me happy. Uh -huh. And it's not, it's not really that hard to do. So, so I think what's, what's super interesting is that we have this remerger that that occurs right so we're all trying to remerge into this thing we do it here and it's forever and it changes your life so now let's say you get this done and you're here well you're here but now you got to do something see see just being here just being merged is one thing you go through life you're da 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 da, da but now we we're talking about how to be merged and then create the life that we want. Uh -huh. so, so don't wait for shit to happen and don't bet on things. Create the life that you want. So, so let's come together and say, okay, um, there are a number, number of different ways to do this thing, to merge and to get, to, get, to, get, uh, to get merged. But boy, once you do it, don't waste it. So this is a lot for my alumni people that have been at everything before, and it's a lot for people hearing it the first time. Uh, what we don't want to do is we don't want to have this tremendous event and then not do anything with it. Uh -huh. so, so let's think about it. Why am I so happy? I'm happy because years ago I started creating this, uh -huh, and now I'm living it. I get to live in it. Right? It's a great, great, great way to get through life is to, to live in an environment that was created out of love, healing, all of these things. It's a, it's a beautiful place to be. Uh -huh. But it's there because when I merged, I decided to do something and I took action. So, so we can always sit back and say, okay, 
I'm centered, I feel good today, this is where I wanna be, that's cool. But the future is coming and you want the future to look a particular way and you can't make it look that way without doing. So here's the thing, it is be, do, have. It is be, do, have. Uh huh. It is be, do, have. Hey Sandra, how you doing sweetie? It is be, do, have. So the being is actually the coming back together. Uh huh. So all of a sudden, because, because if we're split, now we're acting, we're not being. Uh -huh. So we remerge, and now we are be. And now we gotta go to the do in the have. Uh -huh. Be, do, have. So what does that even mean? That means that first thing I better find out is what I like. Uh -huh. If I can't find out what I like, I got a problem. Usually the main reason I can't find out what I like is because I'm unmerged and I'm in this acting mode or reacting or uh, a victim, that, that's it. But once we get past that and we're merged, now all of a sudden we better, we better really, really, really pick our stuff because I have to tell you what, earth time is a ticket. So what is, this, what is this thing about joy? Joy is bringing the astrals, this, 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 this heavenly piece into earth and putting them together in action. In action, 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 action. So yeah, the silent, the silence and the screen. Uh -huh, the silence and the screen. Uh -huh, the presence and the action. Uh -huh, together. Everything is about doing this. It's about being in motion. It's about picking what we want. So in other words, if I, if I know I hate cold weather, then I better, plan, I better not plan on retiring in, in Edmonton, Alberta. Like, if I know I hate cold weather, I better start doing the things that I need to put in action to get me to where I want to go. Uh huh. And we all want to go someplace. I don't care how centered you are, you want to be somewhere. And where does that somewhere want to be? It's somewhere that is consistent with the things that make you happy. Like, I have to tell you what, this is, there's some real simple shit here. If, if traffic makes you terribly pissed off, then please get out of it. <laughs> like, there's some really, there's some really, really easy and, and simple things here. Uh, if you happen to like nature, then get in it. Get in it. Structure yourself so that you can be in it. There are things that are, uh, that are germane to your core of happiness that are simple uh -huh, without getting into to a lot of the different things. So, so let's create a life that, that is conducive with what we want. I mean, look at if, if traffic gets you mad and cold weather gets you mad, then don't plan to, to, to be in Boston for, for th three winter months a year. It doesn't make any sense, right? So, so you gotta get out of, of, of the things that are obvious. And, and so many people, I wanna tell you something. I know some people that, that, that complain about the same thing for 20, 30 years without ever thinking about moving one lane over. Like it, it doesn't even dawn on them. And I think, how can you go through it like this and not get a blinding glimpse of the obvious one day while shaving that, hey, maybe I should be one lane over. Uh huh. So, so let's take a look at those obvious things, but they're, I will say this, when you're merged, they're easier to see. The true and the false show up and you can parse them apart. And what do I mean by the true and the false? I mean something that's symptomatic of a broken me uh -huh, is false. Something that's symptomatic of a broken me is false. Like I'm broken and I don't like blank people. Uh -huh. You put that together, that goes away. Uh -huh. you, put, you put yourself back together and that goes away because, because it goes away, because it's, it's not really real. But some real things like uh, I prefer to live in blank or I prefer this kind of work or I prefer this da 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 da. Okay, now we're dealing with some real things, yeah? And let's just structure ourselves. Let's create the life we want, not hope for it, not bet, not pray, Praying is a part of it, but creating is the active. Creating is a prayer in motion. That's all it is.
Creation is a prayer in motion. So, so I want you to be silent and I want you to be loud. I want you to be still and I want you to be moving because these are the things that get us content. And what are we looking for? We're looking to feel like we matter in some way, right? We're looking to feel like we matter. And if we're not doing what we're doing in the environment we should be doing it in, we're not going to feel that way. So, so by all means, like I tell you what, I, and I hate talking about myself because it, it seems sh wrong, but fuck, I am so happy. I get to do this shit every week. I get to see these people, these miracles happen every week. Why was I jettisoned in here by, through a spaceship? I don't think so. I think that, that I did this, right? And with the help of all of my, my people, we did this together. We took action and we did it. And now we get to live in uh, uh, some kind of heaven. It's a, it's, a, it's a crazy place to be, but it happens because we did something. So, so hear the call and then take the action. If you, you want to really, I got to show you this slide because because this is it. If you hear the call and you don't do shit about it, hell is knowing what you want and not being willing to do what it takes to get it. Having is, heaven is knowing what you want and deciding to do whatever it takes to get it. This is the simplest shit. This isn't hard shit. You don't have to be a you don't have to be a, a, a scientist to figure this shit out. It's easy, beautiful, perfect, and on time. This is the stuff that the stuff is made of. Hey, Meg, here's one of my beauties. This is Meg. We did this together. We created this thing together, and she vibrates like bingo, right? And she's having a wonderful time and, and creating joy with us. This is the thing that I'm, I'm talking about. This is it. So listen, you get merged, you hear the call, you got to take action. If you, listen, you know, if you, if you are merged, you hear the call and you don't, what a, what a tough, that's a tough one. That's a tough one. That's a super, super, super tough one. This is a great one. And I, I said to the people who just got in, people have been saying all week, why are you so happy? Why are you so happy? Why are you so happy? And I think it's because I took action and I created with my co-creators this place and we're living in this joy. It's a crazy joy. It's a crazy fucking joy, but it's joy. It's a crazy place, but we get to see this beauty every week. I'm going to tell you something. I had the greatest time in my life. I came back, JJ, Meg, everybody had, had done such a great job uh, this week. And I got to see this healing without me. So I came back on the last day and I just saw everybody healed. What a fucking great thing. I, we created something that just is a healing machine. What a great thing. Uh, I got to do that. You know, I got to be a part of it. And what I'm telling you is your joy and your bliss is not going to be gotten by sitting uh, and not doing it. Sitting and being in silence and being in prayer and being perfect when combined with doing. There has to be a doing. And, and your, your spirit might be willing and your flesh might be weak. Weak flesh, no joy. Weak flesh, no joy. Uh-huh. You gotta get moving. You gotta get moving. And I'm gonna tell you something. Every day there'll be a million reasons for you to not move. Oh, my toe hurts. Uh, Aunt Betty said this thing wouldn't work. All this shit. Uh-huh. My, my, my girlfriend left me. My wife did this. My, my dog did this. My husband did this. There's a million reasons. My kids are cranky. But you know what? It doesn't matter. You have the ability to do so much more than you're doing. This is the greatest thing. You're such, you have such ability. Take a look at it, you know, and I have to say to myself right now, like I probably couldn't run a mile. But if I wanted to, and with about three months worth of training, I could run 24. Mm -hmm. You have an expansive ability to perform so much more than, you, than you're probably doing. So you can help so many more people than you're helping. Uh -huh. You can have so much more fun than you're having. 
You can eat so much better than you're eating. You can do all of these things better, but it starts with you getting to you. And then once you're in you, you gotta go. You gotta go, you know why? Because in this, in this time, in this body, there's a clock ticking, you know? There's a clock ticking. And you know, the, Vince Lombardi said, he never lost a game, but on occasion he ran out of time. I think it was Vince Lombardi, I think it was. And I don't want to run out of time without winning this game. I don't want to run out of time without, without spreading more love and more joy and, and more, you know, I was a very bad guy in the first half of my life. Uh, and I'm making up for a lot of shit. I don't want uh, to leave without doing everything I could do because redemption is real. Uh -huh. So I want to do it. So, so I, I, hey, I love you guys, Johnny, Sydney, Gina, hey. Uh, but I love you guys, but we got to get in the race. And we can't get in the race if we're sitting on the sideline. You cannot participate in this from there. You can only participate in it from there. Uh huh. You've got to be in it. You know, you've got to be in it. You've got to be in it. Hey, thanks, Scott. That's fantastic. You gotta be, yeah. And uh, uh, and I really mean that. You just can't. You can't do it from there. You have to do it from 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 inside. It has to be done here. And once that occurs, it has to be pushed out. And that's why I've been so lucky. I've been very, very, very lucky. You know, I've been very. Hi, hi, Kendra. I've been I've been super, super lucky. And what do I mean by super lucky? I've been a multi, multi, multi millionaire. That's lucky. That doesn't mean shit. I've been able right now with the help of my team and co-creators to heal over 4,400 people. 4,400 people. Uh -huh. That's crazy stuff. And guess what? It's going more each day. 300, 400 a month. Da, 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 da. The sky's the limit. It just keeps growing because we are the place uh, to do this at. So I want you all to come and I want to talk about something. On, on May 5th, the 12th, Dr. Mario Martinez is coming, and he's mystical outliers, bringing mind-body science to the, com the contemplative journey. He's a friend of mine. He's a wonderful guy. You've got to come here. You've got to see it. Uh, and, and whatever you're doing, if this is on your calendar, if, if you want to come here someday, now is the day to come here, not someday. Get here and get here quick. Get here quick because you're it's gonna make it's gonna make such a difference in in how you experience the rest of your life. Like here's something crazy I want to tell you. We survey people six months after they've been here electronically. 97.55% of the people that have been here say that this is the week that changed their life six months after being here. Don't waste time. Come and see us. And the number here. 866-936-9446. Please contact us. Please come. Now is the right time to come. Please come here and experience this and, uh, and, and I'll see you here. Uh, we've, uh, we have, anytime that you call that number, you can find out the week sign here. I'm here three to four weeks a month. If I'm not here, then, then, then uh, JJ will be here doing my stuff for me with the same team where we always produce the same result and it's always great. Please come here, please visit us and please see, uh, please see us. And please keep being happy. It's easy to do, just get in motion. Do something this week. Uh -huh. God bless you guys and I will see you next week. Thank you so much. See you guys.